In the city of McKinney, there is a war of words and a war over words. Proposition A would change the charter to allow the mayor and council to serve three consecutive full four-year terms. I think the most egregious thing is the wording on the ballot. Tom McCarrow with Keep McKinney Unique urges people to vote no. He says the way it's written misinforms people, says there's no language that it would actually extend term limits from two to three. He reminds us the mayor terms out in May. It's blatant deception, intentional. It looks like um, the mayor is doing this for his own benefit. Mayor George Fuller says it was the majority support of a 21-person charter review committee and council that put Prop A on the ballot, not him. He did push for this to come up for vote in November. There is absolutely no deception. The referendum is written by outside counsel. It is written identical to every single referendum, every charter amendment that this city has ever voted on. A rep for citizens for McKinney urged people to vote yes. They say the largest stakeholders in the community support this proposition because they believe proven, experienced leadership should be a choice on the ballot for voters to consider. They say the term limits are consistent with the, quote, fastest growing city in the country. Tom McCarrow tells us he's heard from voters who say they were confused when they voted. This is exactly why term limits are needed, because we get people like this in office who want to stay in office longer than they've been invited to. The mayor says he hasn't decided whether to run again, even if he could. Says all this backlash from a small minority is targeted. To be constantly trying to tear down this community, to perpetuate some personal agenda, it's, uh, it's disingenuous and it's not accurate. Prop A has been a talker and will continue to be even after November 5th. In McKinney, I'm Jobin Puniker.